Now, if I'm seeing things correctly, and it looks like I am, you can actually see Cosmos's breath, which is kind of weird. This Cosmos is an android, and I didn't think she breathed at all because she lived in space a couple times. It's kind of cool that they would add that in, but it shouldn't be for Cosmos. Oh, great, surrounded. By new enemies! Cosmos, activate Hilbert effect. They still loathe my beauty. And the other one, I assume, still loathes. What was the other one? Grace. They loathe grace and beauty. Okay, let's try to take out those guys over there. Nope, they just loathe beauty today. Yeah, chaos, we can try something. Hey, I got it right! DC! I did quite a bit of damage there. And I should have tried to follow it up. Okay, we will stop with you. Fine. And we should... Oh, you evaded it. Okay, we're gonna try Cosmos. I don't know how well Cosmos is gonna do here, but I'm gonna try. Gonna go for that. God, you know, we cannot get these things to go to the can we? Let the chaos go next. She is not good against these things. What is it, BC? BC hit in the air just the one time, unfortunately. That should be enough. Still point times four. I will take it. Knock you down on the ground. Can't boost anymore. That's fine, though. Didn't really want to go there anyway. Chaos is not my most defensively bulky character. Okay, you're gonna stalk it and save it for the other guy. Because you're good against him. Uh, this should be fun. Let's see what can do. Oh, he's dead already. Sounds good. What were you? You were CB. Pushy on after this. CB did not. Did break him. I don't think yeah, not even gonna be close there. But, okay, I should have boosted. Boosted. Okay, we're going to. Oh, we're going to boost first. Then we're going to stop. Then we're going to boost Sheon again. Maybe. Knock him on the ground there. Give him less damage. I keep trying, but it's not even close. CB. Why can't I knock him in the air or on the ground? That's not going to help. Okay, we're going to stop here. We will wait until the next go. We're not going to do that. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. That maybe not. We'll try it, though. We will try it. We got three attacks. One of them has got to do it. This is it. 165. Oh, come on. That was so close. That was so close. Oh, catharsis gets to live. All right, here I need to boost. Thank you, buddy. That's who it's going to be. Thank you. And we only really get a times two for that, unfortunately. So predictable. No problem. Shion is good against those guys, but terrible against the other ones. A lot of times that does mean that we need to change party members around for a boss fight, which can get quite annoying, but it also is worthwhile if you already know what they're going to be to, who they're going to be to. Turns out, is there nothing up here this time? Nothing on the truck? It must be over here then. Try that! Here we can find a treasure chest with two antidote L's. Let's continue down. Actually, I'll meet you when we get to where we're going now. Let's go and run. Let's head over to the east. Once again, I don't exactly know how they can warp stuff out of people's subconscious, but they do. And we make very circular tracks. 
in the snow that instantly disappear when we leave the screen. It's kind of strange, yet somehow predictable how that works. And they fade away very quickly. A lot faster than you think they would in this light snow. Barely snowing at all. If we head over here, destroy that, we get into a fight. Cosmos, activate Hilbert effect. With a new enemy, uh, we have a piercing scream. I don't like the names of these enemies. It makes me feel like I'm fighting parts of Momo's personality itself or her own experiences or something along those lines. And I don't particularly like that. Right, we're going to stop here. Yeah. Everybody needs to stalk, especially Xion, though. Especially Xion. Everybody stalk so that we can start uh, blocking a little bit. That was not a, a block at all. What the hell is that? That should be good. Let's try it this way. That will do. So then we go CP. Knock him out the ground. Smack him around a few times. Are you kidding me? He gets a boost? That was my whole plan! Out the window now! Now you need to heal yourself! Open ether circuits! Open ether circuits! Fine, whatever! Ruined it! Ruined it! We'll try it again now. Ah, that wasn't what I wanted to do. But that'll, that'll do for now. Okay, let's try it again. CB. Now you go. 1366. Can you do it? Four attacks here. No. This is it. No, you cannot. You need to be knocked on the ground or something. Damn it. Alright, let's try to figure out this one. If I remember right, it was like A B B for this guy last time, so let's try like B B. Oh! B B A maybe? Now it looks like it's ABB again. He does not have a C for me to hit. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Okay. Um, no, it's the chaos. You need to stalk. Chaos, you need to heal yourself. You're you're looking up, Unleash which is bad. Looking up is the same as looking down for chaos. He doesn't do anything by the book. Uh, Lots of you can try you really good for right now, Chris. Nice. We will come back for something good for you later. You stop again. Oh, and he tried to poison all of us. Did not work. Okay. Damn it, this is not working out well for me at all. Stop again. <laughs> Okay, we will try this. Let's try this. There, and stop. A, B, B, down. 269, not enough, but we did. I'm kind of down ish. Fine, we'll heal again. Lots of weak in it. And my need to get the skill points right now is holding me back. That's what I'm always looking for. Okay, we can go off of this. So we'll try this again. Hit him once. Cancel. And then BB, knock him down. That should do it. That should do it. There we go. Skill points times four. Turn cancel. It doesn't even use something. It doesn't even use something. Okay, we're going to stop. Please give me a turn. We are. Very nice. So. We should be able to finish this guy off here. CB. CB, knock him down. As he's knocked down, Shion can't finish him off. Just go all out. I didn't need to go all out, but I did anyway. Damn it, this fight went all too long. Come on, let's go. Yes, let's go. 
do get quite a bit of experience for that, though. You know, maybe good skill points. Maybe. Do need to heal, though. That I definitely knew to do. Let's continue on. Like this one here, and we do get a much better result. Keep it times two. We're going to keep on going to the right. Uh, remember that there is a forbidden zone over there. It is still quite forbidden. Let's just continue going east here. And I think that we want to head to the extreme once again. This place is very complicated, unfortunately. It's starting to remind me, especially with these narrow passages, of Final Fantasy VII with a glacier. That's not a good thing. Going east, I think I might have gone too far, but I'm going to assume that I didn't. There we go, this is what I was looking for, this log here. We're going to we will take the northwest passage, the one in the middle, to find more enemies. So let's continue forward. This probably looks very, very familiar to you, even though it's covered in snow. We need to destroy this, we're pretty much going to be doing the same thing. Forward. Now that it's snow, I am suddenly scared. This game that is probably probably my Final Fantasy VII memories coming back to haunt me. Damn that glacier! Let's continue forward, though, as if those things weren't out to get me all the time. I am dealing with them all a little bit more than I was before. Let's head on up here and get ourselves. Two biospheres, very nice. Have not been using those, I've been using the revives instead. But once again, since I can heal with my reserve partners, they constantly get their stuff back. It's not that big of a deal. Poor lost soul, <laughs> may you be reborn again anew. A new enemy here. Using full throttle right now. It's the same thing as we saw before, really, except that it is. Going green, this is creation type. Now, these URTVs are actually pretty easy for me, so I'm going to try to take out one of them. Uh, it's close this next turn here. Uh, and then we'll push you in the turn again. Let's see. There we go. Yeah, definitely attack here. That is not too difficult at all. So we'll try to focus on this guy. See if we can't get rid of him right now. They don't give very much skill points, so I have no problem trying to take him out, even when it's not the right turn for him. But now that it is, we might as well finish him on the right turn. Down. Just down. Times four? No, that's not anything really to laugh at. Times four. But we will see what we can do against this guy. We'll see what we can do back after all. Doesn't seem to do very much even now. Okay. We'll actually try to do something here. I think that was a white bee, so I'm gonna try it there. Damn, damn. No, it is BB yet again. So we will do what we can with BB. Knock it in the air, is this gonna be good? No. We were close. We can be got like three boosts. Looks like I was judged. Overestimated enemy threat. My data must be updated. Oh yeah, that was, you overestimated the enemy threat, totally. And I lost experience and a good chunk of skill points as a result of that. Damn it. Damn you, Postmates. This is all your fault. Worth noting is that this time... I believe it worked in the last game as well, that when you die in battle and the battle's over, you come back with one HP, which is very nice because I'm very low on revives. I think I have three or two left. We're getting close to getting to level two so I can learn revert. That's a class C thing. We will get there. We will get there. Let's continue on. We are ever so close to being done with level one. I'm starting to get some of the level H stuff, which is very, very nice. And we are at the same save point we were at before. So let's use our knowledge of the rock puzzle to get another item. Okay, especially with the snow. I cannot tell when it's okay to walk. I mean, it's not okay. Yeah, I think that was like, really close to where it's okay. 
destroy the first two. Hit the log once more. Let it roll down the thankfully not frozen stream. And we can head all the way to the third rock here. Where the rock stops. We are free to blow up this crate. Get ourselves a biosphere. Always good to see. I will be back after I reset the screen and the rocks. This time, I do want to actually destroy the first three rocks. This is something that we didn't do last time. But there is something for us this time. One, two, and three over here. Got that, and there is actually a fourth rock that I don't think we've gone far enough to the right to be able to see just yet, but trust me, it is there. Let's see if I can beat the log all the way over there. It does pick up steam as it goes, so it'll probably catch up to me. All the way there. Oh, still managed to beat it. Still managed to beat it here. It was close then. Over here we can find... I want to destroy the other one, but they wouldn't let me. We can find a rock that we can destroy with poor skill upgrade bees in it. Once again, it's not really enough for me to go out of my way to use those. We'll probably use those towards the end, unless I level grind so much that I don't need to. But there might be a boss fight that I struggle with and we need to use those eventually. I will be back when I have them. This time we just want to destroy the law and head across where we can find the same save point where I ended the last session. We are going to end this one here. That is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Zero Saga Episode 2. I've been joined, as always, by our circling squad of Gian Cosmos. Chaos Ziggy Jr. and Momo. I've been most of a hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching. What could be there?